So why do you think web design is important? Why do I think web design, design is important? Well, it's my program area. <laughs> of course I think it's important. The reason web design is important is because ever since the dot-com bubble in the early 2000s, all businesses that have a known standing to the, the public have websites. And whether or not the interfaces change, whether or not the technologies change to make those websites, to make them fit on screens as large as big TVs or as small as smartwatches, it's not a smartwatch, but you get the point. Web design will stay here for a very long time. It is my passion and web design will get you the money. What makes web design important? Okay, so web design development really uh, helps the students to start from scratch, from the beginning, to design web pages. Now there are a lot of uh, third-party software uh, in the market that uh, people can buy and use. But the way we are learning is uh, hard coding it. So we know exactly where we want everything to be. We can uh, differentiate from one pixel to the left or one pixel to the right. So the way we're learning, all the students are uh, building a solid foundation and they know exactly what they're doing. This is very different from anyone and almost everyone is dragging and dropping from like wibbling. Um, so it's important they, including you, have the solid foundation to uh, uh, build a, a web page that uh, they have the knowledge to go anywhere, use any uh, software if they want in the future. But because of the foundation, they are able to build this from scratch. So tell us a little bit about what you've learned in web design. Well, I learned a lot about HTML and PHP and some basic um, web design elements like creating forms and surveys and stuff like that. Would you say web design is very important in the modern day? In the modern day, definitely. It'll, it'll, the um, kind of um, area that web design is in, it'll only expand from here in this technological era. Would you say that the web design program area has prepared you to go out into the world and become a web designer? Yeah, definitely. And uh, what skills should students expect to learn in web design class? Okay, so for web one, students are assumed not having any background. We'll start with XHTML. And then in web two, uh, we go into the uh, server side. XHTML is on the client side. And web two, server side, PHP. So students learn how to uh, manipulate the server side to receive information such as first name, last name, uh, password, social security card, social security number, things like that. Um, so in Web3, we're going to further, we're gonna dig further into PHP and uh, learn more about JavaScript. And in the future, when we have Web4, uh, which is advanced studies, then uh, students will be more doing uh, real-life projects with the real companies out there.